Good evening, everybody. We thank God for this beautiful day. Today is a special day in the life of everybody whom God has given the grace to be alive. We thank God for everyone who is present here today for you were called and you answered the call. Your being here is more than anything else, especially in terms of different gatherings that we have been called for. But this one is a special spiritual gathering whereby we are having a book launch today. The book launch that for those who are authors of different books, there are a lot of different types of proof that anybody can produce. And to produce a book, it takes a lot of effort, proofreading, dictating, dotting, dotting. A lot of things go behind the scene that we might not really say much about, but the end product is what we are all here to witness. Without much ado, and uh, we were gonna kick off this event today, whereby we call on Prince Obafemi Apolluwode to give us the opening prayer before we continue the exercise of the book launch. Um, can we all please rise to our feet, please? Um, I am going to say the prayers in Yoruba. Ogo ni fumbaba. Ogo ni fumo. Ogo ni fumo. Ogo O Lua or Long, Iwo Nioba Adeda Asheda, Jere Nioba Tiakwe for Joni, Adao Joe Jope, Adai by Baku, Adupe Fubori, Tiopejo, CB Wailin. Jebogori konkon so pe jo ni eni lati ba wa se aye ye ifilele iwe nje ngba ti e ba run ti ojo oni ke ma ka si rere ije ile te fi sile koni baje ona te fi sile koni baje asikoni te fun wa aje asiko rere inu yin adun in batti a baron tini, Emma to Bellow or no. I mo ye yum. Neo ye go and be lenny. She born need the conta be, he mean to want to be. I do baby, I want to born on a bower lion. I do baby, and he tell one of a bower lion. Jack batti ever my fibis let on my father, Lucy, a baby. I want to be your own long over. It be Okawa, whom Prophet Marcos, a to be a sumo la chica, whom only will leak in Lolan do it. So, by the way, any time who last will keep me. I'm really. So we were up to one day in Compatakini. Every people near a lay in Yoni could be a gassino, Bobasheri, Lushimaso, in Jebu Bori, Ori, Ori to Wasibil, near me, in Batiba Macheton, Ayulema Mulole, in Jebaba, prophet, no. Jigie kolua koma fo. Eh, kijingie koma koma donsi. 
inu wa kuma du ta ba nri eh leyin ta ba se gbogbo nkan ton aye ayo ni ko yo le fun wa loruko jesu oluwa wa aleluya meje torin le Right, I just want to say one thing before. Can we just be seated, please? Um, it might look scanty, um, but only shoki dikini love the So we might be thinking, is this um, a book launch? But it's not um, barista, it's not wasil. So that's what we should expect. Only dear lakwe, or kolati dear lakwe. So lara mo dear no kolom boka wa. Ingredients one in all Belgi, Ojo, Continuum, one is to be a she ordinary name. The green ingredients speak for me. Um, you can see the simplicity of the gathering. It's not a fanfare, something, it's not a, an hotel venue where we lavish money to do a book launch. That is the dictates of what. Uh, as I normally call the Shoma course, wants. He wants things to be as simple as possible. It is not the environment that really matters, but the purpose of why we are here is what is very paramount to him and people who are witnessing. Those are the two things he said, the people that are here and the purpose of the launching. So he appreciates you all. May God be with us all. The person will be taking us through this book launch in the person of Prophetess to Pumpo Oji Wole. My name is Tokumbo Oji Wole. As our Father and the Lord has said, we thank God for today and everything will be snappy as we know that the Easter festival is rounding up by this time of tomorrow. All of us will be at our place of work. May the Lord bless us all. Amen. And may the Lord bless our pockets Amen. where the money is coming from. It is not easy, as my father and the Lord has said, to write a book. Writing, collating, ministering, everything together. Not one book, two books at the same time. I use this medium. As we see here, we have tables and chairs. Everybody here is a special guest. Whether I mention your name or I do not mention your name, everybody here, as a living person, is a special guest. So in case if I start calling names and there is no more space on the table, wherever you are, it's a special chair. The only person that doesn't have a chair today here is me that is standing. Well, we are all here because of Reverend Dr. Marcos Tibetan. He's the chief host for today who invited every one of us. A seasonal prophet by name, Prophet Dr. Marcos Korodile Tibetan. Fathers, the former mayor of Lambert, in person of Councillor Amino. my 
my list is one of our mothers in Christ, Mother Celestia Oke. To the heart of peace. <laughs> The Shepherd in Church, CCC, Clapham Parish. I have Dr. Dapok Williams. Sister George Andrew, to the high table, please. <laughs> I recognize the presence of everybody, both the young, the old, women, men, children, our grandparents, grandchildren, and everybody. And those who have already arrived and left, I recognize their presence. And for those who are also on their way, that I'm still expecting to see, I also recognize their presence. I have Superior Ogubayo in our midst here. I have Prophet Kikiowo. I have Prince David Obafemi Abolwadi. I have Mr. Henry Balogo. I have Mr. Tunde Disu. Miss Vera Emmanuel. Mr. John Adebi. Mrs. Bome Akerele. Mother Celestia Susan Adekoch, Mother Celestia Caroline Apostelgi, I don't know whether I got that right, Mother Celestia Juliana Babalola, Mr. David Ogilani, Mr. Dave Johnson, Mother Celestia Titi Lyon Adekoki, Special, Special Mother Olua Bingbe, Olumri, I think. I couldn't see that properly. Miss Jumoke Ogumbayo. Mr. Oba Taiwo Jimo. Mrs. Oke, or Mrs. Oke, I don't know because there is no. 
Oh, sorry, mommy. God bless you, ma'am. I also have Sister Taiwo. I couldn't see that one. Sister Taiwo Adivario. Okay. I have Mr. Lawa Rasak. And also, I have my beauty choir, the beautiful choir. And I have all my children in the Lord. May the Lord bless you. Amen. In the land of the living. Amen. And to my senior organist, may the Lord bless you, sir. Amen. God bless me. And to all my lovely sisters, God bless you all. Amen. 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 by the author, which is the chief host. I use this medium once again to introduce our Father in the Lord, who is the author of those two books, which is the Revelation year 2018 and Someone Made Easy, and the person of Prophet Dr. Marcos Tibetan, a round of applause. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. May the Lord bless you. Amen. May the Lord honor you. Amen. May the Lord connect you and even allow your people a dream to be actualized. Amen. Uh, it's a simple, simple way of handling God's things. You see, when you look at the book, the two books, it's about 650 something pages. And that book was completed within one month. So it's not a book of, it's not a kind of book, it's a spiritual book. And even the one of next year is, on the, is uh, already on the table. Uh, I am a member of Celestial Church of Christ, but I'm a world prophet. Anything you want to do, go international. If you wanted to be a boxer in a Bini or Sapple or Etio, or being a boxer in a Ondo state, try to box very well so that people can promote you and the Lord promote you too. Day before yesterday, which I think, was it yesterday? Yes. One of our sons is now. Take, he has already to the place of uh, Muhammad Ali. Hallelujah. Yes, that is uh, Anthony Joshua from Shagamo in Nigeria. Hallelujah. Everybody in Nigeria, well, they, they stood by their television on Sunday, uh, Saturday night, because they have their son somewhere. Now that's what we're doing here again. This book started 2001. And now we produce about 20 books so far. And if by accident I drop there tomorrow morning, I think in another 30 or 20 years people can see call for the book to read. 
And the last election in Nigeria, the law revealed to us that Buhari is not the best president. And everybody was grumbling about it in 2015. And today, we haven't seen him to be the best president. And when you look at it, anything you want to do in life, try and ask God to lead you right. If I want to be the protest of Celestial Church, all these things will be on the book, on the Revelation sheet in the church internally. But the Lord said, is, no, I didn't get you for that. In Jeremiah 1 from verse 1 to 5, he said, right from your mother's womb have made you what? A prophet of the nation. Then in the book of Hosea, he said, by one prophet, the Lord saved the the Israelites out of the land of Egypt. Then in the book of Amos 3 from 4, 5, 6, 7, he said God will never do anything without revealing to a prophet. A prophet is born but not trained. You only born a prophet. You cannot train a prophet. Then when you look at the book, so, uh, uh, the publication, the author did not know anything about the book. Because the secretary, the, the MC said I should say something about the book. I do not know anything about the book. Because they said that the people we gathered in South Africa three times this year, then today when Mandela died, will everybody not gather to come and give the final respect? They will. Do I know anything about the book? No until it happened. Then when you look at Sangai, the, the opposition leader in, uh, to Mugabe, they said he should put his house in order that he may likely live for 2018. He died in February. Do I know anything about the book? No. Because I don't know them and I don't live with them. But the Holy Spirit revealed it to me so, sister, I don't know too much about the book. But the only advice that I want to advise myself and the people coming behind me, anything you want to do, take care of those children. This is when you can take them to where they're supposed to be. In Nigeria, we have a place for young ones and for adults. There are parties you don't carry baby to. So when you look at it, the Bible is trying to tell us that we need to humble ourselves. Anything the Lord wants to use you for in the church, try to do it well. And anything you know you are good in to do, try to do it well. And don't praise yourself in anything you want to do in life. Allow people to talk about you. Even not for the holiday, a lot of people on YouTube, some of my brothers are here. I don't know them, I've not seen them before. But they watch the interview and the book launch on YouTube. The Lord bless the, the YouTube uh, organizer and the man who made us to make the world a, a level playing ground for us. So for you be here today, is the Lord that invites you, not the prophet. What do they call prophecy book? How do we come about pro prophecy? Then how do prophecy do come to pass? Then who is in charge of prophecy? These are the things we need to ask ourselves. Because if we didn't normally pro pro uh, position it very well, we are going to confuse our mind. That yesterday we are going to therefore together. But this man was telling us that uh, there is going to be rain before we get to grace. And after getting about 10 minutes to grace, the rain was already in, in place. So that means this man is different from me. Because when you look at the book of Luke 5, from verse 1 to 5, it said, throw your net to the right side of the boat. He said, sir, we don't want to be rude to you. We'll be toiling all night, and fish never move during the day. But by your word, who will do it? And they threw their net to the right side of the boat, and they caught many fish. 
And when you look at the book of uh, the, the book of man, nine from verse uh, four to eight, and when you look at John nine again, he said from verse four and five, he said, "Let us start to walk now, because the time is coming when we will not have the time to walk again." Then in verse 23, 24, 25, he said, Madam, can you tell us the story about your son? Because we, you born him blind. How come about see him seeing now? He said, he is, uh, is of age. Asking him, he can talk. May the Lord bless your home. Amen. May the Lord bless your children. Amen. May the Lord bless your country. Amen. Because that's little when you hold the book today and read the book, where Nigeria is supposed to be is in that book. What we are missing is in that book. And how to get it right is in that book. If you marry a wrong husband, that is not the end of life. That's what the book is trying to tell you. And if you marry a wrong wife too, or a wrong husband, you should remember John 5. He said you've married five children. And five husbands, and they are not your husband. He said, Jesus, what do you want me to do? He said, Think about the heavenly home. Then go and evangelize and tell people about the kingdom of heaven. And with this, because it said in the book of uh, 1 Corinthians 7, from verse 4 to 10, it said, They will not ask us about our wife in heaven. Not about our country in heaven. Not about the country where we have the citizenship. The Lord will bless you. So please, the prophecy about your life will be actualized if you can have little patience. Because he said, don't kill your dream. Because you still need it. And the Lord will connect you with the people that will relevant to your dream. Yes. After living here, you will not regret. Yes. The Lord will bless your home. Yes. The Lord will bless your work. Yes. And the Lord will bless your family. Yes. God bless you all. Yes. Thank you very much. We have all heard what the chief host had to say about the two books.